What's going on YouTube? GSNR8 here, so in today's video I have great news for those of you waiting for jailbreak on iOS 12.1.3. Yes, you heard me, 12.1.3. So the iOS 12.1.2 and lower jailbreak has been finalized and, you know, it's working, but the iOS 12.1.3 and iOS 12.1.4 remain signed, however not jailbroken. Well, a new vulnerability has been released for the iOS 12.1.3. Now if you go ahead and hear on the about the security content of iOS 12.1.3, 1.4, which basically shows what's vulnerable in iOS 12.1.3. If you take a look in here, there is a foundation vulnerability and it says, quote, an application may be able to gain elevated privileges. And it's basically CVE 2018-7286 by an anonymous researcher and a couple of people from Google and of course Ian Beer of Google Project Zero. Now, this web page in here called Zcaps posted, quote, analysis and reproduction of iOS and OS 10 vulnerability CVE 2018-7286. 7286 and they posted in here all the details about this vulnerability but the important parts are the proof of concept which is attached below in here so if you want to try it out it's in here and also the information about this vulnerability so in the TLDR section in here it says quote CVE 2019-7286 was exploited in the wild the vulnerability seems to be of critical severity and could have been used potentially also to maintain persistence after reboots so therefore an untethered thing and it says in here Zecops were able to reproduce the vulnerability POC below or proof of concept code below but the most important part in here it says quote the vulnerability could be used to escalate privileges to root as part of a chain for jailbreak on iOS 12.1.3 so the proof of concept in here has been attached and if you want to take a look in here definitely do there is a lot of information in here you can use but the iOS 12.1.3 is still signed in here and you can downgrade back to it so if you're running iOS 12.1.4 for any reason go ahead and downgrade to iOS 12.1.3 now if you updated for some reason from the 12.1.2 your uncover failed and you were forced to update or for any reason that you might be on 12.1.4 the iOS 12.1.3 does indeed look better now the vulnerability in here the CVE 2018-7286 has been patched in iOS 12.1.4 and of course this means that the iOS 12.1.4 is not vulnerable to it so if you want to stay on a vulnerable version for jailbreak purposes stay on iOS 12.1.3 so yeah this is the first jailbreak vulnerability for iOS 12.1.3 this doesn't give you the task for PID 0 so it's not a kernel vulnerability however it's still good it's still a privilege escalation which can be used in a potential jailbreak if needed anyways that's pretty much it guys thank you for watching do not forget to subscribe to stay updated I'm Geosnow until the next time peace out